Hello, and welcome to Beamworks University. In this training video, we'll be looking at a general overview of the Invoice module. The Invoice module is where most users spend the majority of their time. It's here where invoices arrive from auto capture email overnight, or are uploaded manually. The invoices are coded, submitted for approval, and then once fully approved, are exported from Beamworks into your ERP. The most efficient way to navigate to the Invoice module is to click on the Navigation pane on the left-hand side and choose the tab you want to go to. We're going to start on the Create tab. The Create tab has all the new invoices that have been sent into Beanworks but do not yet have any coding information associated with them. Once an invoice has been selected from this area, information like the vendor, invoice number, dates, and totals gets added to it by either an automatic overnight process or by someone in your organization. Let's head over to the In Progress tab, where you can see all the invoices that have been created but are not yet submitted for approval. Click to get into the Details view of the invoices so you can see the image and coding details to review them one by one. This is where you'll check over the information already added to the invoice, add additional pages, lines items, comments, and whatever else is needed to complete the invoice. Once complete, Submit the invoice for approval. The invoice authorizers will get a notification. They have invoices to approve on their daily email reminder. These invoices will be in their approvals tab, and approvers will go through and approve or reject them one by one. Once fully approved, the invoices will be on the export tab, where someone in accounting will export them from Beanworks and import them into their ERP, usually through a sync tool or a file transfer. The other main use of the Invoices module is to search and report on invoices. To do this, go to the Search tab and create a filter based on any criteria associated with invoices. Press Search, and after reviewing the results on screen, select the invoices you want to generate a CSV or PDF report of. This concludes our general overview of the Invoices module. Next, we suggest diving a little more deeply into each of the invoice workflow tabs in the subsequent Beanworks University videos. If you have any questions, please contact Beanworks support by emailing support at beanworks.com.